Hello, welcome. My name is Jose Bonilla. You may recognize me from the co-op a few years ago. I am also partner owner with my wife Casey for Bonilla Bread up in Bethlehem, New Hampshire. So I love to cook and today we're gonna make a ham and cheese, ham and Swiss omelet wrap. So with this, you only need five ingredients. You have a low sodium ham, some baby spinach, a couple of eggs, and some Swiss cheese. You could vary this if you don't do the ham. If you're a vegetarian, add some more veggies to it. If the Swiss cheese is not your thing, do some cheddar, you could do some provolone, anything you'd like, and make it your own. And it's a very simple, easy, low carb meal. Now we're gonna chop up this ham. You can roll it up, slice it that way, and we're just gonna chop it after that. Mind your fingers, go nice and slow. I've been doing this for many years, so chopping. I could do it while I'm not looking, but we're not gonna try those skills today. We're gonna make sure everything is great. So, got my ham in there. And it's about an ounce of ham and an ounce of cheese. So that's like a slice of each, if you're into measuring that kind of stuff. Make sure you get just the right amount in here. You could add more eggs to this, make it a a bigger meal if you got some company. You know, the kids had their friends stay over. It's a nice, it's a cool breakfast for the kids. Teenagers, adults alike. Spinach, we're just gonna rough chop this. It reminds me of basil. You could just, basil, you tend to just stack it up and then roll it and then chop it. But we're just gonna stack it a little bit, chop it that way, go this way, just like that. That's called rough chopping. Mind your fingers, keep your hand on top of the knife if you're doing that. There we go. Throw it all in there. That oil looks like it's just about ready in the pan. So mix this guy up. And then we're gonna pour all this in. Same time. We're gonna make an omelet out of it. So we're not gonna move it around. We're all just gonna throw it in and spread it out. And we're gonna let that cook right there. You wanna wait till about the time of that, the, all the way around the edges are dried up. They're cooked. And around that time, we're gonna put our tortilla. Got these tomorrow's, uh, carb-wise, multi-grain wraps. These are great. It's spinach, ham. And notice I didn't put any salt in this. And it's because of the saltiness of the ham, even though it's low sodium, you just get that natural salt from the ham. It's, it'll be nice. All right, so now we're gonna get this guy off of here. Egg is cooked. Slide it right into a plate. Bigger plate if you need it. Let's turn our burner off. Now this is gonna be pretty hot. Just came off the hot plate, right? Off the hot pan, I'm sorry. And then he's gonna roll it up. I, I, I'm used to dealing with hot things, so I'm just gonna roll it up. But I would suggest waiting a few minutes before you roll it up yourself. And that's it. Get that, at the edge of it, you wanna just keep that down and pinched underneath so it, you can let it cool down like that. And we're gonna cut that in half. There you have it. That is a ham and Swiss omelet wrap. Thank you for your time. Enjoy making that. Have a great day.